Here are three huge ChatGPT updates that you need to know about. And number three is a feature three that I have personally been waiting for for ages. It's like ChatGPT just leveled up to superhero status. This is wild. Number one, ChatGPT now has connectors. All you have to do is just go to your settings. Then you will notice a connectors option. And now this allows you to connect to Gmail, to Google Calendar, Google Drive, Box, Dropbox, HubSpot, uh, your Outlook Calendar, Outlook Email, your SharePoint, your Teams. And I'm pretty sure they are going to be adding more connectors pretty soon. Just keep in mind, connectors currently only work with deep research turned on. And the second huge update is projects now have some superpowers. You can now do deep research within projects. And voice mode is also now supported within projects. They have also improved memory to reference past chats in projects. And they have also added capability to upload files and access the model selector on mobile as well. And now for my favorite update and one that I have been waiting for for the longest time. You can now select from all the models in custom GPTs. So I can choose to use 4.0 for general day-to-day uh, -day tasks or I can select 03 when I need to do more complex or advanced tasks. The choice is mine. By the way, if you are not using custom GPTs, you are seriously missing out. I use them all the time to get more stuff done. And the first custom GPT that you should create is a custom GPT that is a clone of you. One that will be by your side and advise and critique you where necessary. And with that in mind, I have created a free step-by-step -step guide on how to create a custom GPT clone of yourself. Just comment custom GPT and I'll send you the link.